Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're taking a nostalgic trip down memory lane as we explore the timeless beauty of Hollywood actresses from the 60s and 70s. From iconic screen sirens to talented leading ladies, these women captivated audiences with their elegance and charm. Join us as we delve into their glamorous past and discover how their beauty has evolved over the years. Now, let's get started. Claudia Cardinali is an Italian-Tunisian actress born on April 15, 1938, in Tunis, Tunisia. She rose to prominence in the 1960s and 1970s as one of the most iconic and influential actresses in European cinema. Cardinali's striking beauty, captivating screen presence, and versatile acting skills quickly made her an international sensation. Throughout her career, Cardinali starred in numerous acclaimed films, working with renowned directors such as Federico Fellini, Lucino Visconti, and Sergio Leone. Some of her notable performances include roles in Eight and a Half, The Leopard, and Once Upon a Time in the West. Over the years, Cardinali has received numerous awards and honors for her contributions to cinema, including the Golden Globe Award for Best Actress. Currently, Claudia Cardinali is 85 years old, and her legacy as one of the greatest actresses of her generation continues to endure in the hearts of film enthusiasts worldwide. Catherine Deneuve is a French actress born on October 22, 1943, in Paris, France. Renowned for her elegance and versatility, she is one of the most celebrated actresses in the history of French cinema. Deneuve gained international fame for her captivating performances in iconic films such as Belle de Jour, The Umbrellas of Cherbourg, and Indochine. Throughout her illustrious career spanning over six decades, Deneuve has worked with esteemed directors including François Truffaut, Roman Polanski, and Lars von Trier. She has garnered numerous accolades, including several César Awards, a BAFTA Award, and an Academy Award nomination for Best Actress. As of now, Catherine Deneuve is 80 years old and continues to be an influential figure in the world of cinema. Her legacy as a versatile and talented actress remains unrivaled, leaving an indelible mark on the history of film. Sophia Loren, born Sophia Villani Cyclone, is an Italian actress born on September 20, 1934, in Rome, Italy. She rose to fame in the 1950s and became one of the most iconic and beloved actresses of her time. Loren's magnetic screen presence, talent, and beauty captivated audiences worldwide, earning her numerous accolades and awards throughout her illustrious career. Lauren starred in over 100 films, collaborating with acclaimed directors such as Vittorio De Sica and Federico Fellini. Some of her most memorable performances include roles in Two Women, for which she won the Academy Award for Best Actress, Marriage Italian Style, and Yesterday, Today and Tomorrow. Lauren's contributions to cinema have been widely recognized, including receiving an honorary Academy Award for her lifetime achievement in 1991. Today, Sophia Loren is 89 years old, and her legacy as a legendary actress continues to inspire generations of filmmakers and audiences alike. Sandra Milo was an Italian actress known for her work in Italian cinema. She was born on March 11, 1933, in Tunis, Tunisia. Milo gained prominence in the 1960s through her collaborations with renowned Italian director Federico Fellini. Her captivating performances in Fellini's films such as Eight and a Half and Juliet of the Spirits garnered widespread acclaim and established her as a prominent figure in Italian cinema. Throughout her career, Milo showcased her versatility as an actress, appearing in a variety of genres ranging from drama to comedy. She received several awards and nominations for her performances, including the Nastro d'Argento Award for Best Supporting Actress. Unfortunately, Sandra Milo passed away on January 29, 2024, at the age of 90. Despite being less active in recent years, her contributions to Italian cinema remain significant, 
and her performances continue to be celebrated by audiences and critics alike. Catherine Ross, born on January 29, 1940, in Hollywood, California, is an esteemed American actress renowned for her diverse contributions to cinema. She shot to fame with her memorable portrayal of Elaine Robinson in the 1967 film, The Graduate, a performance that earned her an Academy Award nomination for Best Supporting Actress. Ross's talent and versatility further shone through in acclaimed films like, Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid, and, The Stepford Wives, where she effortlessly inhabited a variety of characters across different genres. Now at 84 years old, Catherine Ross remains a cherished figure in the film industry, revered for her enduring impact and celebrated performances that continue to captivate audiences worldwide. Diane Keaton, born on January 5, 1946, in Los Angeles, California, is a multifaceted American actress, director, and producer celebrated for her remarkable contributions to cinema. She garnered widespread acclaim for her roles in iconic films such as The Godfather Trilogy and Woody Allen's Annie Hall, for which she clinched the Academy Award for Best Actress. Keaton's illustrious career is characterized by her versatility, with memorable performances spanning comedies, dramas, and romantic films. At 78 years old, she remains a vital presence in the entertainment industry, captivating audiences with her unique style and distinctive performances, ensuring her enduring legacy in the world of cinema. Faye Dunaway, born on January 14, 1941, in Bascom, Florida, is an esteemed American actress celebrated for her indelible contributions to film. Rising to prominence in the late 1960s and early 1970s with iconic roles in Bonnie and Clyde and Chinatown, Dunaway established herself as one of Hollywood's leading actresses. Throughout her illustrious career, she delivered captivating performances across various genres, earning critical acclaim and numerous awards, including an Academy Award for Best Actress for her role in Network in 1977. Now 83 years old, Faye Dunaway's impact on cinema remains profound, her enduring legacy celebrated by fans and peers alike, despite occasional controversies and setbacks along the way. Liv Ullman is a Norwegian actress and filmmaker born on December 16, 1938, in Tokyo, Japan. She gained international recognition for her collaborations with Swedish director Ingmar Bergman, starring in several of his acclaimed films, including, Persona, Scenes from a Marriage, and, Cries and Whispers. Ullman's performances were marked by emotional depth and complexity, earning her widespread acclaim and numerous awards, including two Academy Award nominations for Best Actress. Beyond her acting career, Ullman has also found success as a director, screenwriter, and author. She has directed several films and stage productions, showcasing her versatility and talent behind the camera. Today, Liv Ullman is 85 years old. Her enduring contributions to cinema, both as an actress and filmmaker, have solidified her legacy as one of the most respected and influential figures in Scandinavian and international film history. Meryl Streep is an iconic American actress born on June 22, 1949, in Summit, New Jersey. She first gained widespread recognition for her role in the 1978 film, the Deer Hunter, which earned her an Academy Award nomination. Streep's ability to portray a diverse range of characters with depth and authenticity quickly established her as one of the most talented and versatile actresses of her generation. Throughout her illustrious career, Streep has garnered an unprecedented number of awards and nominations, including a record-breaking 21 Academy Award nominations and three wins. She has delivered unforgettable performances in a wide array of films, including, Sophie's Choice, The Iron Lady, and, The Devil Wears Prada. 
As of 2024, Meryl Streep is 74 years old. Her unparalleled talent, dedication to her craft, and commitment to portraying complex characters have cemented her status as a true Hollywood legend and one of the greatest actresses of all time. Ellen Burstyn is an acclaimed American actress born on December 7, 1932, in Detroit, Michigan. Burstyn rose to prominence in the 1970s with her powerful performances in films such as The Last Picture Show, The Exorcist, and Alice Doesn't Live Here Anymore, for which she won the Academy Award for Best Actress. Throughout her distinguished career, Burstyn has demonstrated exceptional versatility and depth in her roles, earning critical acclaim and numerous accolades. She has received multiple Academy Award nominations as well as wins from prestigious institutions such as the Tony Awards, Emmy Awards, and Golden Globe Awards. Currently, Ellen Burstyn is 91 years old. Despite her age, she continues to be an active and respected figure in the entertainment industry, with a career spanning over six decades and a legacy that cements her as one of the greatest actresses of her generation. Stefania Sandrelli is an Italian actress born on June 5, 1946, in Via Reggio, Italy. She gained prominence in Italian cinema during the 1960s and 1970s, establishing herself as one of the leading actresses of her generation. Sandrelli's natural charm, versatility, and captivating performances endeared her to audiences and critics alike. Her breakthrough role came in the acclaimed film, Divorce Italian Style, 1961, directed by Pietro Germi. Sandorelli's portrayal of Angela, a seductive and manipulative woman, earned her widespread recognition and kickstarted her successful acting career. Throughout her career, Sandrelli has appeared in a wide range of films spanning various genres and has worked with renowned directors such as Bernardo Bertolucci and Michelangelo Antonioni. She has received several awards and nominations for her contributions to Italian cinema. Presently, Stefania Sandrelli is 77 years old, and her legacy as a talented and influential actress continues to endure in the world of Italian cinema. Tippi Hedren is an American actress and former fashion model born on January 19, 1930, in New Ulm, Minnesota. She rose to fame in the early 1960s when she was discovered by director Alfred Hitchcock, who cast her in the lead role of Melanie Daniels in the classic thriller, The Birds, 1963. Hedren's captivating performances in The Birds propelled her to stardom, and she went on to star in another Hitchcock film, Marnie, 1964. Despite her success, Hedren's career faced challenges due to conflicts with Hitchcock and the restrictive studio system. In addition to her acting career, Hedron is also known for her work as an animal rights activist and for her efforts in wildlife conservation. She founded the Roar Foundation and the Shambhala Preserve, a sanctuary for rescued big cats. Today, Tippi Hedron is 94 years old, and her contributions to both cinema and animal welfare continue to be remembered and appreciated. Mia Farrow is an American actress, humanitarian, and former fashion model born on February 9, 1945, in Los Angeles, California. She gained widespread fame and critical acclaim for her roles in several iconic films throughout the 1960s and 1970s. Farrow's breakthrough role came in 1968 when she portrayed the lead character in Roman Polanski's psychological horror film, Rosemary's Baby. Her performance garnered significant attention and established her as a talented actress. Throughout her career, Farrow appeared in numerous films, including The Great Gatsby, 1974, and Hannah and Her Sisters, 1986, for which she received an Academy Award nomination for Best Supporting Actress. Outside of her acting career, Farrow is known for her humanitarian work, particularly her advocacy for children's rights and refugee assistance. 
Now, Mia Farrow is 79 years old, and her legacy as both a versatile actress and a compassionate advocate continues to be celebrated. Barbara Eden is an American actress born on August 23, 1931, in Tucson, Arizona. She rose to prominence with her iconic role as Jeannie in the television sitcom, I Dream of Jeannie, which aired from 1965 to 1970. Eden's portrayal of the charming and mischievous Jeannie captivated audiences worldwide, earning her widespread recognition and establishing her as a household name. Throughout her career, Eden appeared in numerous films and television shows, showcasing her versatility as an actress. She received critical acclaim for her performances in projects such as, Harper Valley PTA, and, The Woman Hunter. In addition to her acting talents, Eden is also an accomplished singer and author. She has received multiple awards and nominations for her contributions to the entertainment industry. Currently, Barbara Eden is 92 years old, and her enduring legacy as one of television's most beloved stars continues to be celebrated by fans around the world. Nancy Kwan, an American actress of Hong Kong descent, was born on May 19, 1939, in British Hong Kong. She achieved international acclaim for her breakthrough role as Linda Lowe in the 1961 film adaptation of Rodgers and Hammerstein's musical, Flower Drum Song, earning a Golden Globe nomination for Most Promising Newcomer. Throughout her career, Kwan showcased her versatility in numerous films, notably in The World of Suzy Wong, 1960, and The Love Bug, 1968, alongside memorable television appearances in series like The Wild Wild West and Kung Fu. Beyond her acting prowess, Kwan is a passionate advocate for Asian representation in Hollywood, receiving recognition for her activism alongside her contributions to the film industry. At 84 years old, Nancy Kwan's legacy as a pioneering Asian-American actress continues to inspire future generations. Ursula Andrus, a Swiss actress born on March 19, 1936, in Ostermundigen, Switzerland, achieved global fame as the iconic first Bond girl, Honey Rider, in the 1962 James Bond film, Dr. Number. Her iconic emergence from the sea in a white bikini solidified her status as a sex symbol and propelled her to stardom. Andrus's illustrious career spanned numerous films, including, Fun in Acapulco, 1963, and, she, 1965, earning her critical acclaim in the Golden Globe for New Star of the Year in 1964. Today, at 88 years old, Ursula Andress remains an enduring figure in Hollywood history, celebrated for her timeless beauty and unforgettable performances. Jenna Rollins, an American actress born on June 19, 1930, in Madison, Wisconsin, USA, rose to prominence through her exceptional talent and versatility in a career spanning over six decades. Notable for her collaborations with director John Cassavetes, Rollins delivered powerful performances in pioneering independent films like, Faces, 1968, and, A Woman Under the Influence, 1974. With an impressive array of roles across film, television, and stage, she garnered multiple award nominations and accolades, including four Golden Globe Awards and two Primetime Emmy Awards. Now 93 years old, Jenna Rollins remains an enduring icon of the silver screen, revered for her unparalleled talent and contributions to the art of acting. Anouk Aimé is a French actress born on April 27, 1932, in Paris, France. She became famous for her captivating performances in numerous acclaimed films throughout her career, particularly in the 1960s and 1970s. 
Aimée gained international recognition for her role in the classic French film, La Dolce Vita, 1960, directed by Federico Fellini. Her career has spanned over six decades, during which she has worked with renowned directors and actors, earning critical acclaim for her talent and versatility. Amy's achievements include numerous award nominations and wins, including an Academy Award nomination for Best Actress for her role in A Man and a Woman, 1966. Now, Anouk Aimé is 91 years old, yet she remains an esteemed figure in the world of cinema, admired for her elegant presence, emotive performances, and lasting contributions to French and international cinema. Geraldine Chaplin is a British-American actress born on July 31, 1944, in Santa Monica, California, USA. She is the daughter of the legendary actor and filmmaker Charlie Chaplin. Chaplin gained prominence for her roles in films such as Dr. Zhivago (1965) and Nashville (1975), earning critical acclaim for her performances. Her career has been marked by versatility, with roles in a variety of genres ranging from drama to comedy. Over the years, Chaplin has received numerous awards and nominations, including several wins at prestigious film festivals such as the Cannes Film Festival and the Venice Film Festival. She has also been recognized for her contributions to cinema with Lifetime Achievement Awards. Now, Geraldine Chaplin is 79 years old, and she continues to be an esteemed figure in the film industry, known for her talent, versatility, and lasting impact on the world of cinema. Joan Collins is an English actress, author, and producer born on May 23, 1933, in Paddington, London, England. She rose to prominence in the 1950s and 1960s, establishing herself as a glamorous and versatile actress in both British and Hollywood films. Collins is best known for her role as Alexis Carrington Colby in the iconic television series, Dynasty, which aired from 1981 to 1989. Her portrayal of the cunning and glamorous character earned her widespread recognition and numerous award nominations. Throughout her career, Collins has appeared in over 60 films and dozens of television shows, showcasing her talent across various genres. She has also authored numerous books, including memoirs and novels, and has been recognized for her philanthropic work. As of 2024, Joan Collins is 90 years old, and she remains an enduring figure in the entertainment industry, admired for her talent, elegance, and longevity in Hollywood. Thanks for watching our journey through the beauty of Hollywood's golden era. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more.